Hello there, my name is Mr. Smordonkey. Welcome back to my last play of Hard West. So last time we left off, we were tasked with defending the homestead. So I think we're just going to do that right now. I imagine this is going to turn into a battle, like an actual like battle. Your family homestead, the bandits were coming. It was the hour of reckoning. You took up defensive positions. You weren't fully prepared. Yet. So I guess this means like you leave and then you can do other stuff. I could buy a gun, but I don't think I need to. So I'm going to take up defensive positions. What does this mean? Prepare for battle. Oh, okay, like a last check. I also checked the cards, by the way. This is perfectly set up, so he with the shotgun has the terror. Uh, and plus four sight as well. Something that makes sense. Um, so yeah, oh, also this guy. As he himself often said, Cheech wasn't paid to, to talk, but he was a competent gunfighter and he didn't flinch from battle. Good for him. Funny enough, our shotgunner has the lowest heat. I still don't know exactly how that's going to work out, but I'm sure it has some sort of sig significance. Anyway... I think we're just gonna proceed to combat. Let's do it. You were well armed and prepared to defend your home from the bad men. <laughs> Stupid bad men. Defend the homestead. If she dies, it'll cost you 200 bucks. I don't even have 200 bucks. How am I gonna afford that? Okay. Let's have a look at the battlefield before we do anything else. Uh, so I guess, yeah, we're all in the house. I imagine they'll be coming from, like, enemies, enemies have been alerted, okay. They probably won't come from this side. Nor, well, maybe they'll come from this side, actually. Uh, I imagine most of them will come from here, though. What's that? We can shoot that. I wonder what that does. Ah, so he has the ricochet ability, tried healing herbs, okay. We can shoot the bucket, too. What was that, what would that do, though? I'm just seeing if I see any shadows that I could fire at. I guess maybe you don't see them... Like, maybe the game recognizes it for you, because you you have to actually be able to fire at them as well, so it'll show you where there's a shadow. Anyway, I guess we should take up proper position. So, you're my uh, shotgun guy, aren't you? Okay, let's first of all switch weapons. Okay, that doesn't take any AP. Can I switch? Yes, I can switch characters. I don't know if I can click on them, so let's not even try that. Uh, you're going to use your rifle as well. I need you inside, though. Um, and you are going to probably use your pistol. I might send him in here or something. But that's a bit risky though, isn't it? I think I'll just keep a pistol on him. Eh. Oh, it could be useful there. Hold on, can you... Shoot that. Ricochet. Ah, I see. Okay. That's the ricochet things you can ricochet off of. Right, I want you inside. I need to defend, like, several angles. I don't know where they're going to come from, so... How about you defend the rear? Or something. Oh, God, I don't know. Oh, there's an upstairs. Well, obviously, somewhere we need to go. Yes, okay, you're going to go upstairs. Uh, I assume we can shoot out those little windows. Oh, I can't actually get there right now. We can, oh, we can't even get close. Well, I think we have to risk that. Just run as far as possible. We can probably get there in two turns or so. Right, and why don't you... I want you upstairs as well, but you're not going to get there. Actually, you can go as, just as far, so it doesn't make much of a difference. Nah, I think we'll do with one guy upstairs, and then the rest will stay down. Why don't you sit over here? Uh, I guess the door would be better. If, we, if the door's going to be open, we may as well sit there, right? Yeah, I guess that would give us full cover. That's probably better. All right, I think you're in an alright position is the thing. Yeah, it's kind of annoying because it, like, it sort of distracts our, um, or it blocks our vision right there, but... I guess I can put him here, but if they then come from behind us and I don't notice that they come from behind us, he's just gonna die instantly. And we don't want that. I can put him here. I feel like putting him in here, though, but then he's so far away from the rest that if he just gets caught off guard or something, he's gonna be dead. Um, I don't want two people in the same room. I should put you over here. It's a bit risky, but I'm gonna go for it. Okay, and there's no overwatch in this, so you are just gonna end your turn. I guess everyone is done. Yes, yeah, so end your turn. Alright. Enemy's already incoming. He's gonna have a crack immediately. Misses. Should be a pretty easy kill for us right there. Enemies are still moving. There's another one with a rifle. Is he gonna have a crack? There's a snake near him. He's gonna have a crack. Okay, we're down to like 
45 luck at this point. I hear another guy coming over here somewhere. Maybe? Oh, here we go. Alright, so yeah, they're already up here. I can get to the window here. I think I may have to, that may have to do... I can't shoot anyway, but at least I can get to the window and I can start shooting next turn, perhaps. Um... Yeah, I might even be able to get there next turn then without having to, like, sprint. Let's do it. This is a bit of a risky move, I suppose, but at least it, like, it'll be good next time. Okay, you have a shot on someone. That guy's eight fucking health. Are you kidding me right now? Okay. Let's, uh, switch to this gun. I want to see. 44 with a shotgun. Wow, that's not bad, actually. Cone shot. Oh, it's like you can shoot more people. Okay, I'll probably have a crack, but I might actually move and then have a crack, because I might be able to get a better shot. Let's see, you. You should have a good shot here. That guy only has 3 HP. We can shoot at 3 people. That guy only has 3 HP as well. Somehow we have a smaller percent chance to hit this guy than him. You do... how much damage do you do? Uh, 4. Oh, well in that case we should go for him. No, maybe not. Let's, um, let's move you over to the window. Or right there. I don't. I, there might be grenades or something in this game. I don't. I don't know if I want to risk that right now. But it does give him full cover. Um. No, let's do it. Take the risk. Okay, and you are gonna have a crack at. I guess I can probably kill both of these guys. You got a 64 on him. 64 on him. E 24 on that one. Okay, you you kill this guy, please. Well done. You m completely messed it up. Good job. Okay, so yeah, our best chance to hit here is this guy right here, 73. Actually, not best, but he dies at least. Alright. Yeah, this guy should have been dead. That's not good. He's gonna try and outflank us now. Have to move someone to the window there. His luck is really low. Oh my god, I think he might just basically be out at this point. He's gonna have a crack as well. He would only lose one HP or maybe two here. One. Okay, ah, this guy's gonna be a good shot for him. He's gonna have a crack at me, but yeah, he's not gonna hit that. Oh, someone just went in there and came out. Oh man, if he had a shotgun right now, he would blast them both to bits. Ricochet, that doesn't really help anyone. 100% chance to hit or 100% chance to hit? Let's uh, hold off on that, we know we can hit someone there. Right, so what have you got for me? Uh, okay, not very good chances to hit on anyone, really. You probably don't either. No, I don't care about them. 44. Uh, Fanning, no. What if you switch weapon? And then do that. Ah, I see. That's how that works. Not quite gonna work, though. Um, and I assume the shotgun doesn't have a better chance to hit here. No. Okay, so we have pretty shit percentages. It's basically what you're trying to tell me, game. Um, so we're gonna have a crack at... That guy, yes, that's the one. 44, really? Fanning... Yes, that guy. 24. Oh, God. That's not very good at all. I could move over here and try and have a shot at him, but he's in, he's in cover anyway, so I, yeah, I just I forgot about that. You can't actually kill them if they're not in cover anyway. Maybe I should come over here and just kill the other guy here. That's probably a better idea, actually. Um, yes, we'll just do that. Unless I want to move him. He can't reach that far. Okay, you move then. Oh, they're intimidated, right, because we've got that thing. Oh, actually, he could now shotgun them both to death, and then maybe I can move him to do something else. That should kill them both, right? Let's find out. Yeah, alright. Kill enemies, remaining three. Oh. Okay, that's not too bad. Alright, I might just run him the fuck away. You. What can you do then? You can go over here. You probably have a pretty decent shot, I would imagine. Oh, I might be- Oh, I can ricochet off that bucket into his face. Let's do that. It won't kill him, though, I imagine, but... That's probably a good idea, right? Let's find out how good an idea it is. Let's see what the chance to hit is. 100! Okay, well, that's not necessary, then, is it? 
Um, damage 2, though, if he ricochet. And then him. It's 4 damage. Which might be important. Hold on. Ricochet off that on him. 2 damage. Oh, man, that... would have. If it was 3 damage, I would have taken that chance. Okay. That's cool, though. I like that ricochet. Hold on, can we ricochet off anything else? Uh, I don't see anything else. No. Well, still, that's worth... I'll take the 4 damage on him. Let's do it. Oh, that's awesome. Alright, now you. I think I might just have to run him the fuck away. If I put him here, this guy's got a flank on him. If I leave him here, I mean, he can only ever take 1 damage. I guess I could even... He doesn't have to ricochet, does he? No. I'll reload that. I don't want to do that. I could do... I could hit him for 2 damage. Hit him for two damage, not really useful. Um, I'll do it anyway. Let's try and hit him for two damage anyway. Um, reloading only takes. Yes, we may as well reload first, right? Just doesn't look like there's any reason not to, because it doesn't use up your turn. God oh, damn it. Oh, he's gonna be outflanking me here. He just used both his turns to do that, though. He's having a crack. Oh no, he's reloading. I should be able to rick I don't know if the ricochet has a cooldown or not, but if not, I can definitely kill one of them. Nice. Miss. Might be time to move him out and just flank him around. But first... Uh... Down. Yes, you. What can you do? No, actually, what can you do? Can you ricochet again? You can! I see. So yeah, I can kill either one of those. I assume, yes. Okay. Yeah, alright. Let's cancel that then. Oh, oh, okay. I want to see what, I just, what else I can do first. So since there's only three guys left, um, I could just... If I can kill all three of them in the same turn, I can move this guy out, just kill that guy, no problem. Um, if I... you know, there, He's not going to be able to get a flank here. So I don't think I can confirm kill all three of them in the same turn. So I don't think I want to move him yet, out yet either. But if I move him away from there, he should be alright. Oh, we do have the fan thing. Or the, um, cone shot. Oh god, that's risky though, isn't it? I don't know how... What's the range on that? Oh, I can't actually use it. Oh, he still has... No, he doesn't. He does have a uh, shotgun available. Maybe it's not available because there's no one in range? Oh god, this is like where I need to learn about the game, but I, also, I don't want to risk losing this guy. I think we're just gonna go for the safe way. Just not kill them all in one go, but we go for the safe, like... Play here. Kill that guy off. Get wrecked, son. Right, you. Now, I guess I can move him over here. That's alright. So at least I have a shot. I don't think it's gonna actually hurt him. Or not enough, anyway. Uh, yeah, two damage. Insufficient action points. Oh, damn it, that takes all. Okay. Uh, shotgun is not going to have a better chance, is it? It doesn't have no, uh, as much damage anyway, so it's not even worth trying. Ooh, the cone. So yeah, that could have worked then. Okay, but it's not working. Okay, well, 44%. I may as well take it. No reason not to. Hey, at least he hit for once. Right. Now, I could still move out of here and kill this guy, but... Which way would this flip? I guess he would then die to this guy. I probably could just kill that guy over there. Uh, I still need to move him away, though, because he's just going to get killed by this man. I don't want that to happen. That's, uh... Oh, I can't jump out the window. That's a shame. Okay, let's just run him away. I think. Yeah. I don't want to lose this guy, because I, I can't afford 200 bucks right now. Yeah, let's just move him away. We, we're not, these guys aren't at any, I don't think they've got a chance to kill me. Oh yeah, he just took the shot right away. Oh, he's gonna, oh. Oh, he's intimidated. Oh my god, that saved my life right there. Okay. So I mean, the thing to find out right now is if this guy can move up here and kill that guy down there. I wonder if I can do it from there. Yeah, this is good enough cover. Let's see if this works. Yes, it will. Okay. Yes. Okay, he's dead. That didn't look like it was going to hit at all, but I'll take it. Right, you are actually outflanking this guy, aren't you? 
but I don't even have to risk anything. I can just walk up here and shoot him in the face. Um, let's not risk that, though. Let's just move him over here and shoot him in the face, or even there. Because maybe this is like, oh, more guys have arrived, and they immediately are just right next to me. I don't want to risk that. There we go. Looks like that was it, though. Mission complete. Yes, it was. Nailed it. If only your prospecting was lucky enough, you can... Oh, we already read that before. Though you survived the attack, Father was worried. He said you should build an underground escape tunnel in case of another attack, but he also wanted to call the shots. Uh, oh, I just made a whole bunch of money. I cash received 300. Character left the posse, Cheech, cart received, and locations unlocked. Yeah, I'll do this. Why not? Father said he'd take care of the materials and construction. Meanwhile, the bandwidths were attacking elsewhere. You meant to make sure... Was, uh, you meant to make sure Florence was okay. Or safe, even. Alright, so we got another card. And we uh, actually keep the items that that guy had. Alright, well, in that case, I guess we'll... Um, we'll make him into a, a ranged character as well, then. I mean, there's no reason not to, I suppose. Uh, Navy gun... Yeah, I guess you can... Uh, I really should give that to the guy who's actually better at shooting, right? Hey, these weapons change around. Already are always like that. I don't know. Uh, right, you take the Navy gun and the repeater. And then you take a six-shooter. Right. See, so yeah, we're back, to down, back down to two people only. Let's have a look at the card screen. We got... Uh, ability Shadow Solve. Passive. Regenerate when not in direct sunlight. Very powerful in nightmares. Okay, and a bonus of plus two defense. I see, useful. And barrage, active requires 90 luck. Holy shit, shoot at all enemies in sight in sequence. Oh, that's pretty good. Well, he's definitely getting that. And regenerate when not in direct sunlight. Very powerful in nightmares. This should technically go to him as well because he's got two more HP, so he can regenerate more. That's my thought process behind that. I'm gonna give that to him too. Fodder is gonna be a legend. What is this? High card. Hand bonus. Plus eight sight. Ooh. Ah. Plus four movement. Ooh. That's very interesting. What if I. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm making very awkward noises right now. <laughs> this is just so. This is really interesting. So it's sort of like a deck, but not really. Because, I mean, this is not just 52 cards in the deck. This is not enough. But that's interesting. So, hold on. Uh, he's got two clubs. Uh, king. Right, so two kings. So, that yes, that would make a pair right there. I see. So, it's definitely... It, it would be worth making actual, like, hands. But currently, the only thing we can make is a pair. But we don't need that, because we've got... Ah, so I guess because he has the high card, so he has the... I guess the king is the high card, so let's... Get rid of this for a second. Give him that one. Hmm, that doesn't give him an eye a card. I guess because he needs to have more cards or something. Well, whatever. I don't know exactly how it works, but this is damn awesome, that's for sure. Okay. Sounds good. Let's keep going. So we're gonna look uh, or check on Florence. We have a whole bunch of money. I guess I could go to the trade outpost, have a little look-see. Also, I have another dried healing herb, so I may as well give that to him as well, then. Can you not carry... No, you can't carry two... Well, you can, but not, like, together. But there's no reason not to have that on him. Although he regenerates as well, so maybe we should give one more to him, then. Alright, so let's go to the trade outpost first. Fuck Florence, who cares about her? He's eager to tr uh, barter, of course he is. Alright, so we still got the shotgun, the sturdy shoes. We already have, like, two items, so that's alright. Tobacco improves aim. Yeah, not really interested in any anything you're selling, sir. I could sell these weapons, but I guess I'll sell them one if I need money. Uh, which I don't necessarily do right now. Okay, let's go to the neighbor's house. Hey, Florence. Florence's parents didn't survive the raid. You found her among the dead. Oh. Oh, never mind, she's still alive. Okay, oh, she joined us. Uh, weeping, she followed you home and never left. She never spoke of it, but brought fresh flowers to her house and their memory every week. Meanwhile, while you were gone, your father has a had a visitor. A well-dressed gentleman with a peculiar accent seemed to appear out of nowhere. His magnificent cologne almost concealed his curious sulfur aroma. Could he be... No, that was madness. Madness? This... 
The gentleman was quite persuasive, convincing Father to spend most of his cash on a lucky amulet. Please don't. He was fed up with struggling, running scared from bandits, crime lords, and the weather. He wanted to be pros the prospecting business to take off, and fast. Still, though, Father seemed loath to discuss the matter. He downplayed the power of the trinket, insisting it probably wouldn't work. Still, things improved. Ooh. Uh, afflicted, affected by amulet power, amulet power, amulet power. Locations unlocked. Things improved. Father swiftly found new digging sites and ex extraction was efficient. Soon he was able to uh, buy better mining license. Oh, we have 21 right now. Holy hell. Okay. Uh, excavation field. Dalton sites. Excavation company. Forest engine. Small bridge house. Crevice. Church. Cro oh, crossroads. Yeah, that was there for a while, wasn't it? Okay, so yeah, we have a whole lot of new locations to go to, it seems. Um, let's have a look at Florence before we do anything else. Florence. You have a little dinky Deadly Derringer. The Deadly was specially crafted for discreet assassinations of heads of state. Two shots per turn. Ooh. Very low damage. Well, actually, not very low damage. It does one less damage. That's not really a big deal. One heat. Damage is soft cover and full cover is the same. It only holds two rounds as well, though. So you can fire twice, but then you have to reload immediately the next turn. Ah, amulet power. The amulet brought from a shady character grants you good luck. Plus five luck per turn. Oh, okay. Same for everyone. Alright. So she only has five health, so yeah, I definitely don't want her to be on the front lines. I'll give her a better six shooter, though. Her. And how about you use her? Actually, what's your aim and stuff? 45. God, you're pretty shit, aren't you? Sight's lower as well. Yeah, she's pretty shit, but I don't... I kind of want to give her a rifle. So that I can take the shotgun again, but I'll do it anyway, but it's kind of crappy. And I'll just give her a regular pistol. So yeah, she has the rifle. Her aim is only 5 lower, though, so it's not really a big deal. Um, do I want her to have any particular cards? Probably not. Shoot at all enemies in the side of sequence. Oh, that's a really awesome card. Generate one on direct sunlight. Yeah. Maybe that should be him on him though, because he's gonna be if he's gonna be close range with his shotgun, it makes sense to give him that. Um, I wonder if that actually if I'm allowed to do that and not lose anything. Yeah, he loses his plus eight sight. I think that's too important to lose. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. He is too important to lose. Sorry. Um, and I should give one of these herbs to her. Uh, okay, that sounds good then. Let's go! Prospector scout, we already, yeah, that's where we got the, um, upgrade thing. Which I'm still not entirely sure what it did, because my money didn't really seem to go up very much at all. Right, let's just head over to the crossroads. Let's see, I want to see what that is. Because I don't think this is a, a site. Some folks said that just before sunrise there was an... Oh, I found an orchard. Electric feeling out on the packet earth on the, of the crossroads, the kind that makes your hair stand on end and sends shivers down your spine. Some swore they'd met a man there, well dressed and well spoken, who offered them a tempting deal. He can make you a powerful. He can make you powerful in return for a piece of yourself. Nah, mate. Man smiled, tipped his hat, and then turned on his heel and left the crossroads. After a few steps, he had disappeared. Though the night was crisp and clear. Yeah, that's like demonic shit. I'm not interested, sir. Although I probably should be. Oh crap, there's tons of stuff over here as well. Evacuation, no, excavation field. Let's go to the orchard, because we're right here. The blind man. The man's eyes have been sewn shut with crude twine. He sat perfectly still, his gun in his holster. His stash on the ground close to you. For minutes he didn't make the slightest noise, then uttered a single slow sniff. He could have grabbed the stuff and made a run for it, but then there was that gun. Uh, I'm gonna read him simply and respectfully. Nodding, he blessed you. Thanks, bud. Thank you for your blessing. I'm not gonna take his crap. He's gonna shoot me. I don't care. He's blind. He's clearly got some demonic powers as well. Everyone's got demonic powers in my end, on my in my book. Let's go over to this excavation field. The site has been very popular back when prospecting was new in these parts, but most have given up on it. All right, let's get that hard rock gold over here. Collect the hard rock gold. Deposit by smashing the quarry stones with pickaxe. Just do all of them. It all makes money. Uh, I should, I'll leave the 15 bucks one. Although the thing is... Oh. You realize too late that your gold had made to Mexico. Oh shit, what has happened? Town... Characters left the posse Florence. Raise your tax to 25%. Oh god. 
He demanded more and more of your profits, and there was little way to stop him. Proud, brave Florence went to parley with the criminal, hoping to appeal his kinder nature. She knew you would never allow it, so she left without telling you, leaving just a note. God damn it, Florence! But the Mexican had no better nature to appeal to. Florence never returned. She immediately prepared to bust her out. God damn it, Florence! Okay, well, we'll bust her out some other time. Uh, actually, no, we probably should do that now. The thing is, I'll go to that town first. Maybe we can hire someone. I think that would probably be a good idea, wouldn't it? Did we get our stuff back? Yeah, we did. God damn it. I just took half an hour to do all the changing of weapons and stuff, and now it's just all back there. Screw you, game. Screw you. Um, Alright, well, that's, that's all good. Okay, I want to go to the town first. But if, yeah, I should really count these. So there's one, two, three. Actually, is this? Yes. Uh, I don't know if that's one, but let's just count it. Four, five, six, seven. Is that really something? I'm I'm counting because of I wonder how many of these. Like if if basically um, like before over here we were able to uh, able to excavate all of them in the end. So I wonder if that's going to be the same here. I probably should have like not gone for that two hundred bucks one by the way and just saved up for the three hundred one. Unless that one only costs a hundred now, but I doubt it. Um. Or maybe you can get all three of them. Maybe it stacks. I don't know. Uh, but it looks like one, two, three, four, five. I think I've got a feeling the church doesn't count. We still have one here, so there should be six then, I guess. Unless I'm missing one. Maybe the church does count as an excavation site. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I guess if that's the case, then all of them will hold free. And I can basically, in the end, go for all of them. But I, maybe I don't want to do that right now. Maybe I don't want to keep excavating because, um, like, maybe we can lower the tax or kill the Mexican. So let's just go to the town because I imagine I can maybe get someone here. You visited a small frontier town uh, made up mostly by miners. One of the shops featured a selection of firearms. Uh, you hired a young miner to help you in prospecting. Okay, that costs a little bit too much right now, but that's probably something useful. You acquired about special mining tools. You paid in for information about mining, additional mining spots. Uh, I don't know how useful that is. Let's visit the gun shop for now. Ooh. Harmonica gun. It's innovative innovative design gives this weapon extremely fast reload time. How does that help me now? Oh, it's got it's just got like ten ammunition, okay. Rami Borgen rifle, five damage. It's affecting us Oh, minus five aim. Yeah. No. Good damage though, but no. 12 shooter, two six shooters engineered into one. What the? These, did these things actually exist? Like, I can imagine some of them probably did, but, like, did, did this really exist? Like, a 12 shooter? It must have done. Revolver rifle. Damage free, really? That's like. Shotgun wedding between a classic rifle and a revolver, revolving magazine. Quick reload. Allows two shots per turn. Ah, okay. Still no. Pepper box, yeah, that definitely existed. I remember this thing. Fanning, A minus 10. Yeah, it's not very good. That's all. No, I don't think I want any of that. I wonder if I should sell this Derringer. I don't think... Like, if I've got a spare six-shooter, I, I probably should. Let's just do it. Uh, I want your money. I'll keep the other stuff, though. Uh, yes. Okay. Trade that. Good deal. Uh, so while we're still here, let's um, inquire about special mining tools. You learn about several specialists who might be able to help you out. Uh, mine office, gold mine office, pharmaceutical shop, and dilapidated mining company. What else? So we can pay for information about additional mining spots, or we can hire a young miner to help in prospecting. I probably should do that. I imagine this will make us more gold, but do I want to do it right now? Fuck it. Let's go mental. You welcomed him aboard for as long as he was around. He helped your operations, increasing your mining income by 10%. And he joined the posse. Ah, cool. So that's totally worth it then. One of the shop. Okay, whatever. I don't want those mining spots right now, although I probably do at some point, but for now, this is alright. So, you, sir, you have a double barrel shotgun, the 10 gauge. Okay, so you look like you're willing to do business. Uh, movement's 15. It's better than his, actually. Aim is 50 as well. He's only got. He's got 10 less luck, and his aim is the same. Defense is a little lower, though. And his sight's almost the same, so that doesn't really change much. Uh, maybe I should become. Maybe he should become the shotgunner. Well, let's check. Let's 
compare these ones anyway. Uh, aim plus 5 and the cone shot. Aim is minus 5 on this one. I actually hadn't realized that. Damage 6 though. It's 1 damage higher than this. Um, heat 1, Heat 2. Damage versus cover and half cover is 2 on this one though. This one's only 1. Ammunition only holds 2. This one does as well though. Hmm, I don't know. I think I'll use this. I could use both, I suppose, but no, I think I'd prefer having one of those on him as well. Right, so yeah, he's going to be my shotgunner, which means he's going to get the boots as well. And I suppose I should give him that too. Oh, right. Card screen. You're going to get that one, sir. So you are my new shotgunner. Welcome aboard. Alright, sounds good. Oh, wait, is he lucky as well, actually? I wonder. He's not lucky. You're unlucky. Okay, well, anyway, I'm going to leave it there. So next time we're going to go to the Mexican town. And I assume there's going to be a pretty tough fight there. But we'll see that next time. Until then, have a good day and goodbye.